But not everyone is keen on giving more money to VIA, including District 10 City Councilman Clayton Perry. Perry says he understands the need for public transportation. He says VIA has improved its efficiency with limited funding they receive. But he struggles with directing more tax dollars to the transit agency without a clear vision. What's the plan? I've lived here in San Antonio since 1991. And um, particularly up here in my district, there's a lot of empty, empty buses. I mean, when I say empty, there's nobody on and I'm, I'm not happy with that. I'm not happy with the answer is we need to just have more buses and a faster schedule to increase the ridership. That's why we don't have riders. Perry says more buses over time will also create another problem due to their weight. Yeah. It's gonna increase the amount of money that is gonna take to maintain and repair those streets. And as you know, we can't hardly keep up with what we have now. Perry wants to see an innovative plan from VIA that doesn't focus solely on adding more buses, stops, or dedicated lanes. One option, he says, is possibly using smaller buses that service areas where people heavily rely on public transit. He's also a fan of expanding VIA Link. Perry says buses and rail systems work better in densely packed cities. I just think this is uh, not the right environment and the right uh, layout of a city to be spending that much money on public transportation.